Happy holidays, everybody. I've got the simplest idea, and I know I say that all the time, but this one is very simple, and you're gonna have all this at home. So anyway, it's a gift box for your gift cards. And you know, they sell these, and when I see them, I laugh. I'm like, people actually buy those? They actually buy a little box? So, here's the deal. This is security, basically, because my mother-in-law got hit the other day by a postal thief. You know, somebody, somebody saw that there was a gift card or money in her envelope, and they took it. They never got there. And that happened to us about five years ago. We sent everything to the niece and nephews of Toys R Us. They never arrived. They never got them. So you're kind of like, oh, well, you know, I'll send some more stuff. But this way, if you send a DVD, you just put it in a regular business envelope. And I think a DVD now to send uh, postal-wise is uh, 310 or 325, but you get a, a tracking number and you can track it on the computer to make sure it gets there. Oh, and by the way, Kat, if you're, if you're watching, your gift is going to make it. It's, <laughs> I wanted you to get a little taste of Texas and I felt terrible it hadn't arrived yet, but it's on the way and it's, I tracked it and it may be today, I think. So anyway, it's, it's going to get there, but this is the best idea. So go get your old DVD boxes and you could send money. You could send, you know, a gift card, you know, a picture of something, whatever, whatever you want. And you can do a theme. And that's what I like about these because I can do a theme of what I'm sending the person, you know, whatever, whatever their gift is. So this one I just thought was cute because I wanted some Hello Kitty wrapping. So what I did was, all you're gonna do, you, first you go get your DVD box and you take off the movie cover. And they're easy, they rip right off. And I didn't wanna, you know, I didn't wanna show movie because I didn't know if I could get in trouble for that. But then you get, you can use your Christmas cards. This is an old, you know, this is a Christmas card. I, I passed these out years ago. And it's a kitty cat with a snowman, look at that. A snowman kitty cat. And I thought I'd keep this all cat theme. So all I would do is I'm gonna just use whatever glue you have I like the I like the school glue, just the you know, washable Elmer's, whatever it is. And all you do, and I did you know, I just did a kitty theme. But here's the here's the best part, you know, if somebody got a new dog, I thought, or they need pet food, start doing your theme stuff. You know, here's a here's a, a dog, a dog a Christmas card. And what you do is you you could gift wrap it. So. I kind of cut this one a little bit just before, but you could do a PetSmart. You know, you could get them something from PetSmart to buy dog food or whatever for their new dog. So this is where the whole theme thing comes from. And you're gonna love this because I cut out uh, for restaurants. Here's the best part. If you're giving someone a hamburger, you know, a hamburger restaurant, you know, In-N-Out Burger, whatever, uh, McDonald's, what you know, whatever you like, Make this your cover for your DVD a box. And here I have wine, if you were giving somebody a liquor store, you know, or here's a smoothie place, you know, you get you get some fruit here. And I just thought this was so cute. I thought, you know, and I, and I have been doing this because we send gift cards up north and I was afraid they weren't gonna get there. And what I did, I just gift wrapped it. I just gift wrapped the box because that's another idea. You know, you get to these family functions or whatever, and I know we're not going out much, but you know, everybody's unwrapping gifts and that person doesn't have anything to unwrap because it's in an envelope and you feel bad. You're like, well, you know, I got you a good gift, but they could unwrap this. You know, you could gift wrap. You could, un, you know, gift wrap. Uh, un, ugh, I can't talk today. You could, un, you could unwrap a, gift card in one of these boxes. So when I see these for sale, please don't waste your money, $3 to buy a gift wrap to do a little box. So anyway, let me start real quick. I'm trying to go fast because I don't want my stuff to run out. Okay, oh, well, I don't know. I'm gonna stick with this wrapping. I'm gonna stick with this one. And what you do, make sure though, make sure before you, you measure this, that it's gonna close because I kinda, I fumbled around first and what happened was I made it too tight and then it ripped. So you're gonna have to make sure that the box closes when you do the glue. And like I tell you, just just go ahead and do the glue. And if you want to get started, you can even do a little bit of tape. And the tape wasn't bad, it just held it in place. And you do the, you do the little roll, you did the little tape roll. 
and here you go. And this is just simple. Use whatever glue you have. I love this little roll-on glue. You know, I'm older and, and they didn't have this when I was in school, so this didn't come around until later. But the Elmer's glue would be kind of wet if you use that, because I thought about that. And see, that might leave a mark, so just do it along the sides. I'm just going quick for y'all real quick because I don't want it to look, you know, I don't want to take too long. And trim this up. But this is just the cutest thing ever. I thought to myself, this way you get tracking. And the per and it's so funny because, you know, the person's gonna think, oh great, I'm getting another bad movie, you know? That aunt gave me a bad movie. Well, surprise, you're getting a, you're getting a gift card. And here we go. Okay, so you can break, I know you can do this a lot straighter. Okay. Okay. I trim that up. Okay. And see, it kind of does leave a little bit of a, you know, bubbled look. So be careful where you put your glue. But like I tell you, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do, I'm going to do the car. Well, you know, I got this out of a calendar and the funny thing about it is <laughs> this is so hilarious because I'm going to do this one for my husband because I'm giving him a car wash. I'm going to give him a car wash. <laughs> a gift card and, and I know he's gonna open it up and go oh wow I'm getting a Corvette you know just to be funny oh look at that she's gonna give me a Corvette no I'm not I'm giving you a car wash gift card to go get your truck your old Chevy truck detailed and washed down the street there you don't even have to wash the vehicle so, you know, make these a theme, you know, just to make them a little bit fun. It'll get people laughing on Christmas morning, like, oh, well, what's this? So, I just thought that was so funny. Now I need to cut this straighter. I wasn't being very neat. Okay. And then, you know, add your ribbon. You know, add your ribbon on top. And if you're mailing it to them, go ahead. You know, you can make this fancy. Just go ahead and do it really nice. You can put it in a little in a little cellophane bag. I've got these little bags next to me. But I have to show you one more because I'm invited to a wedding. I know, I can't decide if I'm gonna go. I'm a little nervous, so I don't think so. Uh, and I feel terrible, but okay, look at this. Look at that. You know, you put that in a little envelope, in a vanilla envelope of business. No one's gonna know. No one's gonna steal your gift cards. You just, you know. They open it up, you know, they're wondering, you know, I got a gift wrap DVD player. I don't know what it is, but you can make it the theme. Go ahead and do this in a car wash deal or, you know, give them some, you know, chamois or whatever, you know, gift wrap for, you know, I got you something at AutoZone. I think that's the best idea ever. So you've got two here. I did a cat theme because my friend likes cats and I did this one for my husband. But if you're giving Italian food, I thought I love this for Italian food. So anyway, here's the, uh, here's the idea for our friends, kids. Okay, they're getting married December 12th, and uh, we, got them the, we got them the gift card already, but like I tell you, I think I'm just gonna mail it. You know, I think I'm just gonna, I think I'm just gonna mail this because I don't know if we need to be around a lot of people right now. We're in Texas and I'm scared, you know, I'm scared. So I'm gonna go ahead and what I was gonna show you is, I would use this, I would use the gift wrapping. Now, I don't have any wedding paper, but I could just go ahead and I could, let's do this. Let's act like we're doing this one. But you use this, and they did the save the date. They sent us this little card to save the date. And I feel terrible, you know? But you could put this card on, on the front, and then that would go ahead and be their little, you know, their little, a little gift box and you know they're gonna be like oh you know it's got our picture on it what's in it well you know it's your little gift card for their well there it is it's their gift card for the registration that they wanted they registered there so anyway I just thought this was such a cute idea and I have another idea after this but I wanted to go ahead and bring this one to you real quick so but I love the hamburger one I thought this was great you know Dairy Queen you know whatever in and out burger whatever. So I thought this is a good idea. And you know, I know Kat, you're a foodie. So this, you know, you could do anything spaghetti. I couldn't find a bowl of spaghetti, but I wanted to, cause I thought that, uh, the Italian restaurant would be a great deal, you know, with the spaghetti theme. So, you know, 
do it, you know, do whatever you can. I know you have these at home, so don't spend any money and don't go out. You know, if you have to be, you know, quarantined, don't go out because we're, we're getting to be like that too. So anyway, take care and thank you. Thank you for coming back. So have a good day.